Health Forum, the importance of networking, né? it's really very good because we said in the constitution, we, we've set up HODs, we've got health, we've got child protection. Uh, we don't just looking at uh, what we're doing as health. We also do as our choice coming from the meeting of the youth planning a youth program now because that is one of the intervention that we, we, we must do ne? with our other organization. Then we've got ECPF, Community Policing Forum. Ne? When we talk about e intervention in terms of, e, in terms of e, 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 e crime, we don't have to fight crime as, as health forum. We refer. We, we had rob, 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 robbing of the trucks with medication outside the clinic. We organize a e e unit to come and sit with us with neighborhood watch with the police so that the police can make turns at the day hospital and check uh, what time are those thugs um, doing this and what intervention they can do. That's the importance of networking. We're also networking with UCT because we, there's nothing that we are getting from the Department of Health. There are no resources. They can talk nice with their budget and do what, what, what. And luckily now we've got People's Health Movement, that arm steering committee of that even support us when we need intervention to do programs like uh, COVID-19 and also it built up on uh, second layer leadership on e health committees and also strengthen health committees also, you know, because if it was not for PHM, we wouldn't be here, you understand, because e-health department doesn't give us even a cent. So that is the importance of networking. What are we doing besides of e -E -E networking? We hold accountable those other structures that also are networking with us. What are they doing? If we said we've got an old age in, in Kukuletu, why health, health forum must run around seeing that those seniors that are sitting there, they are getting their rights, and they are structures that say they are board members in that uh, facility, you know? Hold that board members accountable, you know? Even in police station, we have got a program that is going to be run now even by UPEM for intervention of the gang that is happening in Barcelona. So health forum are part of those intervention. We even come up with this e e intervention that let us draw in our pastor's mini, uh, 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 um, fraternal because they must mentor those boys. There must be someone from Kukuletu that is going to be mentoring those boys and see that here is a successful, successful pastor, you know, with education, with what, having her own, his own household, own children and all, you know, so that they can come out from the background there, you know. So networking is good by that. You don't work hard, you just refer. You don't put everything on you. You check what are the as stakeholders or what the organization are doing uh, things relevant to EE drug. Ne? Urealistic is just here next to us. We just send those boys to Urealistic and see with their parents and go for the counseling. The importance of having this health forum is to network, have all these organizations have a representative amongst us and you must really know your area. If you don't know your area, you won't be a successful uh, health forum. Because once you know your area and you know the resources amongst your area, it's good when you come across the problem, uh, the, the challenge, you refer to the relevant um, stakeholder. When I came on board, I wasn't famous as I'm famous now. I'm very much famous because why I did my networking. You must network when you are in something so you can win other, other people's confidence. So you can use them and they can use you. 
So what, what, whatever come to, to your side, you know, okay, if I can't do that, I can go and ask some, maybe someone is going to assist me, people you met in the network. And what I also can say is, you must have a backbone. If you want to start something, you must have a backbone if you can't or you are listening to, because people outside there, they will tell you, no, don't go like that, go, go this way, and that is where you are going to lose your concentrate, because you must concentrate what you are doing. Well, I'm a health forum member, I'm a volunteer. I'm doing that volunteer, you find your way out by networking. If you're sitting at home, you think things will come to you, I will never come to you. You have to take a step forward and network, then you will find yourself somewhere. And it doesn't take one year or two years. I've been held committee more than 20 years. The forum is well equipped, well educated, well networking because we are involved at the school. Because as a one, I was one part of the SGB of the schools. We were also involved in a crime business because we've got a partnership with the police. We're also involved with the dirtiness of our community because we've got a partnership with the city of Cape Town. And we've got also a partnership with, also with our councillors around. Whenever there is an issue around our community, there is a strong partnership with them. Health Forum is a platform Whoever need any assistance can go to, because they got everything. You can, if we wanted to know about the school, but now recently I was also involved in a school, at a high school, whereby the children, they're using too much drugs, they suspend the children. Then I'm the part of that child so to assist at home, to, to monitor that child, whether she's doing his homework and she's behaving at school. If I can refer, I'm busy now referring the child to the social worker. Where can he speak what he really needs? I'm also preparing the child to go to the intervention in our community, whereby they're dealing with the children who are using the substance for interventions. The, the Health Forum uh, strength uh, is that uh, they are able to to uh, to have to reach uh, out the various sectors like the old uh, the ECTs uh, like um, disabilities. Uh, so um, all these uh, various sectors have uh, the the most common thing is. Uh, uh, they are expressing uh, these health problems on their daily lives. So um, the Health Forum is able uh, to get them together, to collaborate with them so that um, uh, solutions can be found. Um, I will make, how, how did the Health Forum uh, uh, collaborate with other stakeholders in, in our community? I will make an example with uh, 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 the umbrella board that is Kukuletu Development Forum here in Kukuletu. Uh, they've uh, uh, had their HM and then they approach us as a Health Forum that they need us because we were the only structure that we're doing uh, health and we're active doing uh, uh, programs in Kukuletu. So we formed a part of, part of the Kukuletu Development Forum. Even in the HODs after the, the AGM, they've asked us that, uh, no, we can you please head uh, health in, in, in this structure, you know, in this sector. So. I'm heading, uh, uh, um, my portfolio in that structure is health. Everything that is health related 
in Kukuletu. You know, it comes first to me, then we will see as health forum, how do you work, how do you work with other stakeholders that are in Kukuletu. When I'm talking about stakeholders, I'm, to, I'm not talking business, I'm talking about uh, other organizations, NPOs, NGOs that are in Kukuletu. Network and relationships are very important because we have PHMU who part of our networking, whereby Novi now is part of the doctors at Hruskir. Whenever we got any misunderstanding about the doctors and we wanted to know anything, why the cancer they identify in the fourth stage, Novi is there to question them why they are always postponing whenever you get a, one must have an appointment, maybe we've got a cancer people at Hosker, why they keep on postponing. The networking is very good. It, it exposes us to, 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 to advance people where can we have more information about the health issues. People that want to set up a health forum, the only thing that uh, I would say, uh, I can see there are many challenges in many areas because uh, there's a duplication of same structures that people are establishing. People are st establishing NPOs because they see there's money in social development, there's what, what, and what, what. If you really want to serve your community on health issues, know your community, sit down, and do mapping. Get people that are have the same view. You can see even in a meeting who is interested in doing what. Then you just to, hi, can I see you after the meeting? You talk to those people. If you have the same aim and objective of saving community, do a mapping and sit with, start with three people, sit with those three people and check. Now, even if it's a soup kitchen, people, you talk to them. What are the challenges with the people? Because they start with those people that are queuing for a handout. You cannot wait for handout every day, you know. Can you do something about those people that are queuing? You know, before we had the, even a problem, people were saying, once we, 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 we challenged them about defaulting on HIV, they will say, no, I didn't take my tablet because there was no food at home. Then where we started to have food gardening, because even myself, I wasn't the one that liked vegetable. But after I became a health activist, I was eating vegetable, you know. I didn't even know that the spinach can grow so quick. You know, even in three weeks, four weeks time, you can have food in your table. So today we've got a lot of food gardening. We've got people that do their own veggies at home. No one can complain that I'm defaulting because there's no food. There are organizations, there are our agriculture, there are about our Zukila that we refer. Even last week I was walking up and down with those girls that are doing women on change in Pukuletu because they said, Sis, no, we, after the program is finished, we don't want to sit at home, we want to do something. So it's not a matter of sitting in your corner. Really, you have to be bright in the corner where you're sitting by doing something. You won't be bright if you're sitting at home. Nothing will come to you. You have to take a step forward and do something. Then you will be bright like my T-shirt. <laughs>